Hey guys, I'm Adam. I'm Ryan. And this is Two Neighbors. Ryan, what do we got going on today for these lovely people? We are back with some more Zebra Corner. It's this one- It's been a while. It has been a while. It has been a long time. Um, absolutely love Zebra Corner. I haven't been keeping up with it. And this was a request from SFOT Media. So thank you very much for sending it our way. Um, very excited. I love watching Zebra Corner. You brand know. new one here. I don't know if it's brand new. I just haven't seen it. It's brand new to me. We haven't seen it. Um, and this is Mark gets a job at Mark Wahlberg Chevrolet. So this is very exciting. Mac it's, very, from it's very Mark Wahlberg. Yeah. Uh, maybe Mac he's from, from Boston. Boston. So maybe it's just because he's from Boston. Yeah. Uh, so yes, very exciting Zebra Corner coming up. Uh, but before we get into it, guys, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe to the channel. Two Neighbors it takes two seconds of your time. Don't forget to turn on that little bell for notifications because we post content all the time. And please also check out OKSwag.com. Punch in Two Neighbors in the coupon code to check out to receive 20% off plus free shipping and pay no tax on some sweet Canadian swag. Ryan? Yeah. And the you guys in Boston right now, pay in Canadian dollars. Canadian dollars. Bonus. Let's, All right. Let's roll. Mac. Mark Wahlberg Chevrolet. <laughs> Other face. pictures out front, eh? Hey, thanks for coming to Mark Wahlberg Chevrolet. You looking to buy a Chevy for you or like a gag gift or something? <laughs> yeah, I'm actually talking my daughter her first car. Why? Don't you love your daughter? How's the gas miles on this? You remember the BP oil spill? It's that bad. <laughs> you're not going to be worried about gas mileage anyway when you broke down on the side of the road. You're going to buy the car or you're just going to stand around asking me questions all damn day? Hey, thanks for stopping by, karaoke DJ Khaled. Now, Mark, remember what we talked about. What, man? I haven't shit in the microwave since you wrote me up for it last time. Besides, whatever that Indian guy what? in finance eats... No, no, the other thing. Oh, don't be shitting on the Chevys? That's right. You can't be doing that. I know, man. It's just... the Chevys, you know? Oh, trust me. I get it. But Mr. Wahlberg didn't invest all that Transformers money to have this place fail. Another customer. Remember what I told you. Big smiles. Go get them, Muscles. Don't you fucking touch me. Hey man, you gonna buy this Chevy or what? I'm just looking, thanks. Why, are you high or something? <laughs> yeah. What type of features does this have? Features? It won the JD Power Award for, uh, <laughs> for best tires. JD Power Award, huh? Yeah, yeah. JD like Power. That, uh, it also won the JD Power Award for best, uh, best gas. Best gas mileage? No, no, best gas. Gives you wicked gas just driving. You know, to be honest, if you stick around long enough, they'll probably give you a J.D. Power one, too. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty cool, I, I guess. My God, you're a fucking idiot. What? Uh, nothing, man. I, I said you're a fucking idiot. I, I mean, you're a tool. I, right, I mean, go fuck it. yourself. <laughs> God damn it. No, I almost had that one. Now, Mark, what I tell you about the J.D. Power Awards? That they just made up fake awards that we paid for that have no real meaning? What? No, the other thing. Don't be making up fake JD Power. Just <laughs> use the real ones we actually bought. I mean one. Yeah, but we all know that initial quality thing is bullshit. It's like buying fruit. I mean, initially it's ripe and delicious, but then it rots to shit. Well, I know that. But you can't keep calling the customers idiots. Uh, all these rules. You know, anybody that steps on a Chevy lot deserves what they get. Speaking of, here comes one right now. Tell them tell that him and the truck look good together. You know, compliment them. Smooth talk them. He's getting all the ups Chevy today. car sales going to be the best. <laughs> Lie. <Yeah. laughs> hey, man. Nice tits you got there. You want to buy a Chevy? <laughs> what? Uh, <laughs> yeah. You look real good next to that Chevy. Marky you want to whip your dick out and see if the truck makes it look bigger? No. <laughs> look, you want to buy a Chevy and not Vince McMahon boobs? Dude, fuck you. Hey, uh, thanks for stopping by, Avenge Seven Rolls. What? You told me to compliment him. Hey, how sturdy are these trucks? I mean, it depends. If you're gonna leave it parked in a garage feather, it'll probably be okay. You know what? Let's find out. <laughs> the animation. Look at that. It's not fucking sturdy at all. I just kicked the bumper right off that thing. <laughs> you know what? This is really therapeutic. You wanna give it a go? Really? Yeah, let's kick the shit out of this thing. All right. No, come on, man. Really lay into it. All right. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. Oh, my God. Mark, what did I tell you about kicking the Chevys? Not to. 
Yeah, exactly. Also, please don't encourage the customers to keep vehicles, okay? I just got word that Mr. Wahlberg himself is coming in today. So I need everyone to be on their best behavior. Right, Ma? Why are you always single me out? Because you're the only asshole that works here besides me. Also, for God's sakes, don't ask to see his dick. This isn't Boogie Nights. Yeah, uh, I definitely wasn't gonna ask that. <laughs> Look, God, I think you'd be better off in like a Ford F-150. A Tacoma if you want something smaller. There's a Ford dealership just four blocks that way. Tell them Mark sent you. <laughs> I think I'm gonna go see my wife. Another satisfied customer. No, not another satisfied customer, Mark. He didn't buy anything. Yeah, I know. I'm doing God's work here. <laughs> Look, there's another customer, okay? No bullshit this time, or I'll fire your sweet, juicy ass! Man, get a haircut. Hey, what are some of the perks about this car? Perks? About a Chevy Avio? Well, uh, no one's ever gonna wanna steal it from you. <laughs> you can never go fast enough to kill yourself in it, that's for sure. And if it breaks down, it's got these little straps on the bottom. You just throw it on your back and just walk the rest of the way. <laughs> okay, I'll take it. What? No, man, you, d you definitely don't wanna do that. It's basically just a Daewoo with a bow tie on it. And I'm pretty sure Avio is Spanish for toilet. No, it's perfect. Perfect? What are you, a blind man? You know, let's get you a safer vehicle. Like the bus from the movie Speed. The boat <laughs> from the movie Speed too. No, nah, man, you convinced me. I'm taking it. Look, there's no need to rush this decision. Have you, have you test driven a Honda? There's a dealership a couple of blocks away. You know, I'm pretty sure Hitler drove an Avio. Do you have AAA? Yes. You're gonna need quadruple that. <laughs> Thanks. What the hell just happened? <laughs> wow, great job in that sale, guy. And Avio, <laughs> you must be like the best salesman here. I can't believe you just did that. Don't remind me. Holy shit. You guys filming Daddy's Home 5 here? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, what did he do this time? I'm so sorry, Mr. Wahlberg Mock. You're fired! Pack your shit up and get the hell out of here! Hey, don't be giving my guy no attitude. How about I hire one of my brothers to take your place? Because I will. There's tons of us. I like the white version of the Wayne's family. But I thought... But you thought what, you piece of trash? Huh? You were going to fire my best salesman? Best salesman? No, but he... But, but he what, huh? Look at him. He just sold an Avio and already he's smooth talking to another customer. It's pretty much just a giant pile of shit. Dude's about as tricky as M. Night Shyamalan, whose number I have on my phone right now, because we're about to start filming the happening too. You got a problem with that, pal? Pack your shit up, tough guy. You fired. But I thought. That... Get the fuck out of here before I recreate the scene from the movie Fear. You're his <laughs> boyfriend, and I'm playing myself. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> apply for a job at Nicholas Cage Toyota. I hear they're hiring. <laughs> Nicholas Cage Toyota. <laughs> hey, Marky Mark. This guy don't want to buy a car. Hey, Mark Wahlberg! Hey, you giving my guy attitude? You want some of this? I just asked if it came in blue! It comes in white, so you buy it in white. You know what? I think I'm gonna stop bench pressing in front of your wife. You know, just because you starred in three Will Ferrell movies doesn't mean you can treat customers like this. <laughs> I'll treat customers however the fuck I want. You know, I co starred in a movie with a teddy bear twice. You think I play by the fucking rules, pal? Welcome to Mark Wahlberg Chevrolet. This is my jam. Well, there you have it. Another there zebra corner for you. That was pretty good. I wonder, like, I mean, people must tag Chevy in this all the time and, like, send it to them. Like, I wonder what they think. They probably enjoy it. They don't care. Yeah, I'm sure. They got lots of money. I know. <laughs> they're doing just fine. Yeah, so. they're, unfortunately, they're not investing that money into actually building their cars, but hey, you know. <laughs> no, I'm okay. I'm all about electric cars, and I hear the Ford F-150 Lightning is fantastic. Ford's pouring a lot of money into their oh, electric car builds. Dude, I yeah. want an electric car. I don't know about you guys, but electric cars are cool. But I'm not Ryan's a gearhead, I'm so not there yet. Yeah. He's not there yet. But hey, we all we all got to do our part. It'll be my know. next car for sure. Yeah, and as soon as the government makes me, then I will. So. <laughs> Just like the COVID vaccine. Yeah. Um, so great video, Zebra Corner, awesome stuff. Uh, guys, if you have a request, hashtag my request down below in the comment section with your link, and we will do our best to get to that video. And don't forget to check out okswag.com, punch into neighbors in the coupon code checkout, and you get 20% off plus free shipping and pay no tax on some sweet Canadian swag.
Ryan? Yes, sir. You know what to do. Like, share, and subscribe. When you hit that subscribe button, make sure you turn on the bell for notifications. We post new content all the time, and we don't want you to miss it. That's it for our show. Thanks for joining us, and we will see you next time. Later, guys.